uh, the, uh, the title of my study is Special Education Teachers, Perception on Teaching Transition Skills for Students with Intellectual Disability. <clears throat> Today, special education is aimed at the practical community inclusion of students with special education needs. Uh, most special education teachers and parents of students with disability focus on preparing to live as an independent adult after graduating from high school and a productive member of community. Because students with intellectual disability have a limitation in, in the conceptual, practical, and social adaptation skills, as well as intellectual deficiency <coughs> compared to their age, the school curriculum is designed to enable them to acquire fun functional life skills through appropriate transition education tailored to their individualized special needs. Although Students with intellectual disability have received special education through three years of junior high school, three years of high schools, and two years of post-secondary education. They have now achieved the successful <coughs> changes in outcomes. So the purpose of this study was to investigate the level of awareness of the importance level and purpose level of special education teachers on Transit skills that students with intellectual disability should learn so they so that they can have successful transition into other tribe. Through this study, uh, I want to provide basic information to enhance the importance and performance of transit skills needed in the field so the student with intellectual disability can have a transition into successful other tribe. <coughs> The specific uh, purpose of this study are first, to determine teachers' perceived importance and performance of teaching transit skills to students with intellectual disability transitioning to other two. Second, to investigate transit skills that needed to be taught for students with intellectual disability. <coughs> for this study, I used a survey study I, uh, I distributed the survey for 200, 200 special education teachers. Mm. So 200 education aides were, were distributed and 100, 144 questionnaires were collected with the cooperation of special education teachers in Daegu. The total of 104, 144 questionnaires were analyzed. <coughs> the questionnaire items were based on the domain of the skill necessary for the adult life, suggested by Strington 2000, in order to examine the teacher's perceived importance and performance of teaching students with intellectual disability, the transit skills. <coughs> I used independent t-test and IPA analysis for, compare, for comparing the perceived interest perceived importance and actual performance. Then, investigate the transit skills that needed to be taught for students with intellectual disability. Uh, the result of this study are as follows here. Mm. This table shows teachers' perceived importance and performance of teaching transit skills to students with intellectual disability. This is perceived importance, this is perceived performance. There is <coughs> a significant difference. This shows the t-test uh, result of difference. So, the teacher perceived importance and performance of teaching transit skills for students with intellectual disability uh, were examined based on 10 domains. The 10 domains is communication skills, academic skills, self-determination skills, interpersonal skills, community engagement skills, independent daily life skills, interdependent life skills, leisure and aggression skills, improvement skills, skills for participating in the post-secondary education program. So, <coughs> yeah. 
then um, as shown in the table one, the average difference between the level of perceived importance and perception, perception level of actual performance of teaching 10 domains of train skills was significantly significant, uh, statistically significant. Tab, table two, this is table two. Table two shows the top 10 train skills with the largest difference in the level of personal importance and perception level of actual performance. The greater the difference is, the more it is required to teach the skills at this point for successful transition of student with intellectual disability. <coughs> this is table three. Table three uh, and picture one shows importance performance analysis, IPA analysis of teaching 10 transit skills by using mean difference between the perception of importance and performance. So this table, importance performance analysis of teaching trans care, show uh, <coughs> I, I divided 10 transit skills uh, as core categories. Concentrate here, keep up the good work, low priority, possible over cares. So in the concentrate here domain, there is interdependent life skills and interpersonal skills. In the keep up the good work domain, there are communication skills, self-determination skills, improvement skills. In, in the low priority domains, there are skills for participating in the post-secondary education program, community engagement skills, and academic skills. In the possible over care domain, there are leisure and recreation skills and independent daily life skills. So, <coughs> as you can see, there is a figure, uh, figure for showing these four domains. There are four domains. Here is concept here. Here is keep up the good work. Here is low priority, impossible over cares. There, <clears throat> in the four domains, there are 10 skills. Mm. Yeah. So, through this study, we, uh, I noticed the special education teachers perceive the importance of teaching trained skills for students with intellectual disability. However, their performance uh, is lower than their perceived importance. So, <clears throat> I want to suggest special education teachers have to concentrate for teaching interdependent life skills and interpersonal skills uh, rather than leisure and increased skills and independent daily life skills. Thank you.